have three timeouts, so the clock's not that big of a deal. But they're going to go fast and try to steal possession. Stafford going deep. He's got a cup open. He's got it. And he's taken down inside the 25. Cooper Cup gets open deep. Watch this little. They call it a rocker step. Watch him lean onto that right foot. That is elite route running. He has made his impression felt. Great job by this offensive line, giving Stafford time to step up. Doing what he does best, the clean pocket. Matthew Stafford says accurate and as good of a passer as we've seen. Shared one previously. You know the feeling. Second it down at four. Stafford throws near side. Cooper Cup. Cup inside the 20. And then finally brought down by Marco Wilson. This is what I love about when you disrespect one of the greatest players at wide receiver right now. This is what happens. You should never, ever put a linebacker one-on-one -on, -one on Cooper Cup, period. Matthew Stafford recognizes it, Cooper Cup recognizes it, and they make you pay. That's exactly what's supposed to happen. Sending his team here. From the 25, Stafford going deep, looking for Cup. He's got it! For Cooper Cup. Look at the concentration and... He's not the fastest guy, but he's able, as I mentioned before, use his body. He stacks that cornerback. So if you notice, Keetro Clark had no chance to make a play on him and win that game. And look at him now. He's still getting after it. Third down and eight. Tenth play of the drive. End zone. Touchdown. Cooper Cup. For Nick Rowles, defensive coordinator, Cooper Cup is on a rookie one-on-one -on -one with no help. That is going to be a touchdown nine out of ten times. Matthew Stafford puts it on the money like he always does. And that was such a good-looking drive that he goes back to the football, makes his quarterback right every time. Stafford to Cup. Right, let's see. There's the catch. Right foot down, drag. That is a completion. It, it's not an easy thing to do to Montrevious Adams, and, and he was able to get upfield and disrupt that run play. Empty set, Stafford with five in the pattern. He's got Cooper Cup with space, and he taps the toes for a catch near midfield. Then they get 24. There's the left and the drag of the right. Stafford looking, throwing, he's got Cup, he's got the two, and the Rams have a seven-point lead. Pressure from the Packers, a flag is thrown, ripping downfield, and on the first target of the day to Cooper Cup, he connects, but will it stand? 34 to Cup. And Cooper Cup, just a little bit of a wiggle at the top of the route, and I think Anthony Johnson just a little bit late getting there really kind of developed in front of him if he's reading it well he's going to be able to make a break on that ball get there a little bit sooner at least challenge the he's done a whole lot with the rams until recently makes the catch right there from the 30 fake to williams cups wide open cross the formation and nobody went with him he takes it inside the 10. first and goal for los angeles cooper cup is in motion is is anybody running with him no <laughs> You're running the other way. I mean, look at that space. How does that happen? How do you have a breakdown like that when it's one of the guys that you have to be concerned about? It's a 34, actually gain of 27, and I think we're, we're even now. Ravens bringing some pressure. Stafford trying to beat it. Wants Cooper Cup, and he's got him at midfield. Beating Mullen and then breaking his tackle and running inside the 35. That's the second time today we've seen Matt Stafford feeling the blitz. And again, it, to have these plays, you, you got to have protection. We talked about the blitz and how many looks you get. That's pretty good right there. Slows him down. Keep your head up, Kyron. That's the biggest thing. Don't let your head get over your feet and get that forward lean. But again, the second time we've seen this chemistry, we saw it on the touchdown play. This ball is thrown well before Cooper Cup has even cleared that spot. Beats Arthur Mollett right away over the top. But I love the effort. Stafford quickly to Cup. Cooper Cup made a miss. Threw him off. First and goal. 
They do such a good job with the motion here to get everybody out flank. But again, we saw this earlier this half. It's the it's the run after the catch. You're trailing. You, you've got to come to balance as you get around Cooper Cup. And you just put your foot in the grapes. Whoops. There you go. And stepped out of bounds at the six. Mark it at the five. And again, Cup came out of the game there wincing. They get turned. Stafford launching. He's got Cup. Cooper Cup makes the grab into field goal range for his best day of the year. Uh, just a little bit late. Marlon Humphrey going right back after him. He's got his eyes. He's directing traffic. And Cooper Cup runs it out and up. Cup in motion. Stafford off the play fake. Looking long for Cooper Cup. He's wide open. He's got it in stride. He's going to go in. 62 yards. What a breakdown by the Commanders. And the Rams capitalize right out of the gate. Watch right here. Benjamin St. Juice. And look at this. James. Right, right here. Like, what are we looking at? Two guys just letting them run completely free. You got Curl and St. Juice, and nobody picks up Cooper Cup. Second and goal. Stafford sprints out, throws. Cooper Cup, touchdown Rams. Inside, he's going to chip first and then get to the flat, and it slows down the defender just for half a second. But when you slow McLeod down,